Not so fast. New Year's isn't over quite yet. In fact, South Florida is celebrating the Japanese New Year this coming Sunday. That's pretty cool. Tamara Joy, the chief curator at the Murakami Museum in Delray Beach, is here to tell us more about that. All right, so 2019 is the Zodiac Year of the Pig. So ah. what are we in store for? Oh, Well, also referred to as the Year of the Boar. Yeah. Um, you can use either one. Okay. And Nothing boring about it, though. It's going to be a good uh, year. Yeah. It's, a, it's a good year for puns. I can see that already. <laughs> uh, the year of the boar. The boar is associated with courage and adventure. So oh, wow. if you were born in that year, it's a really great sign. It's also the 12th sign of the zodiac. So it's kind of at the end of the line before you start oh, wow. over for the next cycle. Huh. You guys have um, at the museum a whole list of activities and, and things planned for your guests. What are visitors in store for? Well, it's going to be a great day filled with a lot of um, visual imagery that you would find in Japan in celebration of the new year. One of uh, the very popular characters you'd find is the Daruma who is the um, founder of Zen Buddhism wow. and represented here as kind huh. of this little roly-poly mm -hmm. guy. And the, the story is that he meditated for so long and so many years that his arms and legs just shriveled up. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and he's just now, a so story. he kind of can bob up and down in the, and there's also a little parable. If you knock him down seven times, he'll get up eight. Oh. So this is about So he's goals. very resilient. Good. And for New Year's, the idea is you go to a shrine or a temple and you'll notice that this Daruma doesn't have any eyes. Mm -hmm. So the idea is when you take Daruma home, you paint in one eye oh. and you make a wish or a goal. And then you set the little Daruma in your house somewhere where he can look at you all the time and remind you an to achieve you. that goal or that wish. <laughs> and when good. that happens, you paint in the other eye. That is so fun. And then you take wow. him back to the shrine or temple the following year and all of them get burned in a kind huh. of ritual and then you pick up your next daughter and start over. Wow, that's an interesting hmm. story. Uh, uh, what about, so, do you guys do this every year? I mean, I'm, I'm familiar with some of the other, the year of the cat, the year of the dog, the year of like the pig, the boar. So every year it's uh, similar? Uh, yes, uh, the only, and as you mentioned, the only thing that changes is what zodiac sign right. that oh, is associated. Okay. Last year it was the year of the rooster. Oh, what's the most popular, would you say? Oh, I can't say because <laughs> all of us are represented the, the by the year of the boar. Yeah, yeah. No, to the, yeah this Let's year's talk year. food. You guys are going to have some yeah. food. We have um, sake. There's what in the new year in Japan. There are lots of firsts. There's mm -hmm. the first soba noodles you eat, the first Ooh. sake that you drink. One of the most important foods you eat for the new year is mochi, and we have some samples here of uh, the sticky rice that's pounded into a kind of a you know, a dough, and then mm -hmm. it's filled traditionally with red bean paste. So we'll have a demonstration of mochi pounding, mochi. which is you take the rice and you, people get wooden mallets and in it, this large go to work. mortar Physically and pound it until yeah. it's this kind of sticky substance. And it's a very important for community and family members. Everybody takes part, grandma, the grandkids, and How then many people you all have are you your, guys expecting? Gosh, I don't know, there, there might be Four to five thousand. Wow, this is a Somebody big deal. Yeah, that, but um, we also have um, activities for the kids, like this little mask right here. There'll be mm -hmm. mask making activities, and of course, you have your little boar, your little pig. All right, how nice. um, yeah. Also, John, I see some this piece right here. Yes, thank you, I appreciate it. <laughs> we have a little pig, more of a pig than a boar, uh, represented by one of our local artists, Don Yoshino, that you can find in the gift shop. You know, and the kids are going to get an education about you know, the other parts the of the world. Too. And, yeah, well, the yeah. adults, of course. Yeah, that's good stuff. All right, so if you want to go, the tickets start at uh, 10 bucks, and they're available at morikami.org uh, and not .com. Camera, thank you so much. Have a great time. Thank, thank you, you very and much. Happy New Year.